Did she start? <laughs> she just stole my car. Welcome back to Summon Tesla. Today I am actually having a ton of fun because I'm over at the Supercharger and I'm charging up the car mainly because, while well, she needs a little bit of a charge, which is basically a good thing. Oh, there's my wife right there. I think she's doing a vlog. And the cool thing is today my wife actually went and started her um, courses for, well, driving lessons, which is bad for me because if she started her driving lessons, that means that she's gonna wanna drive the Tesla, which I'm okay with, I'm okay with. I have to buy her probably a car. I wanna buy her a Model 3, but she doesn't, I don't think she wants a Model 3 right now. I think she wants like a little cheap car that she can mess around with. But uh, with that said, I'm curious about your opinion. Should a new driver have a Tesla? And I think this is, this is one of those things that I'm, I'm kind of looking at like, is it a good idea? I think it is, but then again, the old style cars, you know, the good old uh, gasoline cars, they're harder to drive. I guess you learn a little bit more. At the same time, I think there's also a cool little aspect to that, and that is that with the Model 3, you know, it's easier to learn. In the Model 3, you really see a lot of things, and it's really wide open. You can, you get a nice view of the road if you will right i don't know it's it's a tough call but i would love your opinion on it i think there's some benefits to having you know to having a a scenario where you can actually drive like your first car being a model 3 a tesla model 3 i think that's pretty neat i kind of wish i had my first car as a model 3 i believe it or not guys my very first car was a chrysler reliant i actually had so much fun in that car um, at one point I even had a little Fiero. Those are a lot of fun too. But um, that's besides the point. Model 3 for her first car, should I? She's dancing around, like literally, look at her. I don't know if you guys can see her, but she's just like dancing around back there. <laughs> she's dancing around back there. But uh, yeah, I, it's a really, really tough thing to figure out like what what is the best way to approach this? Like what is the best way to kind of go about uh, deciding on what's the best car for somebody because as your first car typically the, the rule of thumb for me has always been get a car that is that is um, easy to learn on you know high vis a safe car obviously and you want it to be you want it to be a car that is well what's the best way to put it I guess just easy to learn on and I don't know I really want to know from you guys do you guys think a model 3 would be an easy car to learn on. I think it is in many ways because the car is really, really simple to drive. It's, you know, your visibility is just awesome. It's excellent. So it's a, it's a really, really tough call. It's a really tough decision on, on what's the best way to do this. Now, like I said, I want to buy her a Model 3. She, on the other hand, is more against the idea of having a new car. And, you know, I guess she's just kind of worried about you know what if you damage it like she doesn't mind uh, the idea like I'll for me to teach her in like parking lots or anything like that you know on the with the Model S and I let her take the Model S out like you know here and there and I kind of teach her how to park and uh, just kind of get a feel for for driving did she start <laughs> she just stole my car <laughs> oh my god <laughs> she just stole my car. Oh, bugger. Seriously? Seriously? Okay, and she doesn't want a Model 3. Figure that out. I don't get it. And I know she wants a Model 3, but she doesn't want me to buy her a Model 3. But she does this. Like, I, we come to a supercharger, and then she'll just do this kind of stuff. You know, like... I don't know. And what? wait, the car's supposed to be charging. The car's supposed to be charging. Hold on, you can't, what do you mean you can't hear me? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Sorry, uh, excuse me, ma'am. You know this is considered, uh, I, I want to charge the car. And? So I am making a video, basically talking about the fact that you don't want me to buy you a Model 3. You want to get like a, a ICE car. First of all, this is to 
you know, this is a Tesla channel, so you shouldn't even say that. But you want to get a nice car because you feel like it's a better idea to have a nice car over a Tesla. Is that it? We want an explanation. My viewers want an explanation, my darling. By the way, those of you guys who have not seen uh, my my wife, this is my wife. And so we need an explanation for this. I'm going to park. What do you mean you're going to park? Man, so she doesn't even give us an explanation. She just like runs away. Oh, she's gonna try and park in a stall. Let's see how well she does. Yeah, she's gonna mess this up. Yeah, okay. Oh, I love the look of this car. Actually, this might be beneficial to me because now I get to like actually see my car running around. Okay, but this is besides the point. Okay, what I mean by this is besides the point is the fact that I was gonna ask you guys, please let me know what you guys think. Is a Model 3 a good, um, is it a good first car? Is it a good first car for a new driver? And I'm looking at my little screen over here and, holy moly, she parked, what the? Hold on, I gotta show you guys this. Not bad. I mean, not great by any means. I mean, that, 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 that's, that's like a weird angle, but... So now that you parked the car... Well, I wanted to be out of the pedestrian's way. You want... What pedestrian? You're the in a park... Was, the one that was walking through when you stopped me. There's like nothing here. So, are you recording? Yes. Oh, she's recording for our other channel. Oh, okay, cool. All right, so, um... Explanation. We need, we need a little explanation. Do you actually... Uh, are you serious? Like, would you actually like an ice car over a, well, electric car? No, of course I wouldn't. You wouldn't. But the whole thing is, is the reason that I'd want an ice car <laughs> over an electric car is because of the overall cost of buying another electric car versus buying an ice car, which I can learn on. And if anything goes wrong, I'm not going to feel as bad. Okay. I gotta tell you, I have a very hard time arguing with that. Do you guys agree with that? Please let me know in the comments below. And uh, in the meantime, I'm gonna let you guys be because she's dri she's driving off again. She's just she just takes off. That's I don't like this whole thing now because I feel like I'm I lost my car. All right, that's the end of the video. Um, uh, if you guys want to see some more stuff on what she's doing right now and what she's uh you know all the behind the scenes stuff and all those things i do have another channel i would love your support on it it's uh my youtube life i'll leave the link uh in the description below and if you guys want to support me on that channel great it's gonna be a good little place to see all this kind of silly stuff where she's i don't know basically behind the scenes that's really what it's gonna be uh, a lot of the stuff on this channel i, I try and keep everything as uh straightforward as possible as clear and simple as possible and the only way i can do that is by actually you know keeping things organized but there's a lot of things that happen behind the scenes there's a lot of things that i i don't want to put in the channel a lot of silly stuff a lot of my screw-ups and basically just uh, what it means to be a youtuber and what it means to be you know doing what i do so that channel is starting up uh i just started the channel so if you guys want to, again, support that channel, go ahead. There's going to be a link in the description below. With all that said, I'm going to say thank you very much again for watching. You guys are absolutely amazing. You guys always are. Your support has been spectacular. I were just shy of 500 uh, subscribers on this channel, which is actually amazing for me. So for this channel, it is. I love it. Thank you very much for watching. Till next time, drive safe. Bye-bye.